how's it going? Welcome back to my channel if you haven't been here before. My name is Samantha Galloway. I think I want to start calling myself the Boho Witch. Not too quite sure though, so let me know if you like it down in the comments. Anyways, welcome back to my channel if you've been here before. If you haven't, I want to invite you to subscribe and hit that bell so you never miss another video. Today we're going to be unboxing the December Enlightened box from Awakening in a Box. And I got a little sneak peek from their Instagram and I know it's going to be water element energy, so that's why you see my little seashells all up here. So super duper excited about this one. Uh, my husband is a water sign, so I'm excited to see what we got in this box. So let's open it on up. So the Enlightened box is their second tier crystal box, and it has five crystals in it. Um, two are guaranteed to be bigger or a little bit different, and then it gives you a couple other gifts to go along with their theme every month. So in every box, you always get this beautiful art print drawn by Eli Valorso. Uh, you can check him out on Instagram at E underscore V underscore Gypsy if you want to. And then on the back, it just gives you all the information about all the stuff that's in the box. So let's dive on in. I'm so excited. Ooh, this, this is an abalone shell. I can already tell from the holes in the back of it. I have a bigger one. It's blue, but this one is white. It looks so beautiful. So abalone shells obviously are connected to water. Um, I use my blue one right now for an incense holder and I'll probably use this one to hold my water crystals in because it looks so nice. Now let's see what else is in the box. I always feel like I'm treasure hunting with all of this fluff, it's so cool. So let's see what's in this bag. Oh, this has got to be our small crystals. So we'll get these out and get these organized. I like to do that because in one of my videos, I got mistaken and told you one rock was a different rock and I felt so bad about it. So now I have to get organized before I do anything. So we'll lay these out. And then we will find the little info cards that come with the crystals. So Awakening uh, gives you these little info cards. It tells you the name of the crystal. It gives you a little affirmation, some information about the crystal. And then at the bottom, it tells you which uh, chakra and zodiac sign it aligns with. So it gives you a lot of really good information. Alrighty, now that we are all nice and organized, we will open up these bad boys. This is my favorite part. Look at all the beautiful crystals. So this one is Appetite. So appetite is a really good balancer of energies if you're feeling kind of out of whack with your emotions or your chakras or anything like that. Um, it also really helps to develop psychic gifts and connect the user to higher levels of your spiritual guidance. So that's awesome. All right, we'll get into the next one, which is aquamarine. So aquamarine resonates really heavily to the energy of the ocean, helping you to connect with the nature spirits of the sea. It has a high soothing energy, like that of the ocean waves, so it's a really good stone for courage, protection, and to calm fears and phobias. All right, now we're down to our last small crystal of our five. So this one is Ocean Jasper. Ugh, why is it so hard to pick things up with nails? All right, slide it up. <laughs> So, Ocean Jasper is a variety of jasper that contains circular or orb-like inclusions of quartz or feldspar. It is a nurturing and protective stone, and it also promotes patience, releasing emotional blockages, and expels pent-up anger. That's good. Like, so they're all, like, they all remind me of the ocean, like, ocean waves, like, whenever I go to the ocean, I just release everything, and I always feel a lot better when I leave. All right, next thing we got is some lotus incense. Incense is always amazing. So burning lotus is good for cleansing or to use during meditation. Ooh, sparkly bracelet. Ooh, pretty. So this one is made from obsidian, quartz, bloodstone, and mother of pearl. Beautiful. Set that over here. All right, see a couple more things in here. Ooh, what is this little bottle? Ooh, it's a Roly Atlantis water element roll on. 
So it's made with fragrances and oil that embody water energy. Nice. I gotta see how it smells. Mmm. Delicious. It embodies the ocean and Atlantis totally. <laughs> I love it. All right. Let's get our other crystals out. I'm excited to see those ones. Oh, here's one. Mmm. Oh, it's a heart. Oh, this has got to be the fluorite heart. Oh, this is beautiful. I don't have any stones that are shapes. This is my first one. So fluorite is a very protective and also stabilizing stone, useful for grounding and aligning your spiritual energy. And crystals that have been shaped into hearts uh, increase their loving energy. So that's really good. Ah, oh, beautiful. I love it. All right, last crystal. Oh, it looks like a shell. Ooh, this is the ammonite. Ammonite? Let me know if I'm saying that wrong. <laughs> so ammonite is actually a fossilized or crystallized shell. Its spiral shape symbolizes continual change and evolution. Ammonites have absorbed cosmic energy over eons of time and help stimulate the life force within. You can put it in your home to attract health, prosperity, and success. All right, last thing we got. What is this bag? Oh, it's got Metatron's cube on it. That's cool. I release stored energy and invite light and love. So this is a crystal cleansing bag. So you're supposed to put water safe crystals inside of it to cleanse them. And it has that cool little affirmation on it to give more positive energy. That's awesome. Well, that box was awesome. I'm so excited about all my new water energy crystals and gifts. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Share with your friends if you think they'd enjoy this video, and click that subscribe button and hit that bell so you never miss another one of my videos. Alright guys, as always, be kind to each other, do what you will, but harm none. Alright, have a good one. Bye! Mm -hmm.